I'm Jonathan Andrews with Boss Rooms here at the beautiful Blue Ridge Parkway. Excited to bring you a tiny home tour in under two minutes. Let's get it. So in this series, we're gonna be touring tiny homes and small spaces from the state of North Carolina and beyond. Our first stop brings us to the Hawthorne Skyloft right here in North Carolina. Hey, I'm running out of time. Let's get to it. Fireplace, shower, art gallery. Toilet. Whoa, 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 guys. It's a little fast, even for me. Come on, let's go inside and check out the real layout of this place. So as you come in, it's great. You've got plenty of seating and storage, storage flanking both sides. Alternate to you is the kitchen layout. Really nice functional kitchen layout. But a feature I really want to point out to you is how they operate their shower of all things, right? What they've done is they've made this extension on here to where we can connect it to the kitchen sink, cut on the water, Cut on the shower, boom, spick and span. All right, so after you're all nice and clean from your shower, you come inside, it's time to rest, right? You come on back, they've really done a good job of tucking a nice size queen size bed into the back. Now, back here, you can see you have a beautiful window that gives you a view out the back. However, if it's really a beautiful view you're in the mood for, it's not inside you wanna be, it's outside. So let's go check that out. Hello up there, all right. So look, this is a gr another great example of how you maximize space, right? We just had downstairs. No, let's, let's build a bridge. Let's build a sky bridge up to upstairs and just double the space. This is, this is perfect. You know, when it comes to tiny homes, small spaces, and of course, boss rooms, it's really about maximizing the square footage that you have. And this is a perfect example of that, right? From the seating up here, hang out, play some board games sit and lounge with your mosquito net, keeping all the bugs out, or just being up here and enjoying the view. There's, uh, there's a lot to love about being up here and just spending time in this great example of a tiny home. All right, so this concludes your tiny home tour in under two minutes. If you enjoyed this, follow along for more.